In this video, I'll be talking about multi-file analysis. Sometimes customers need to do analysis on multiple files together and later import another set of files to repeat the same analysis. But as long as all the analyses are done in one book or sheet, you can use such book or sheet as a template for further import. Here's one example. First, let's import three files. Choose data, import from files, multiple ASCII. Please note that it's called ASCII import, but you can also import multiple CSV files with the tool. Let's select three data files, such as sensor 1 to 3. The first file import mode defines how the first file of the three will be imported. The multi-file import mode defines how subsequent files will be imported. You can start a new sheet if you want each file in a new sheet, or we will choose start new column to bring all the files into the same sheet. Each file contains a set of XY data, so let's expand the column node and set column designation to parentheses XY, so the columns will be XY, XY, XY after import. Expand rename sheets and books node. Don't rename sheet or book with file name. Instead, check the add file name user parameters row, so the file name will be put to a user defined parameter row and click OK. Three files are imported into the same sheet, and the columns are xy, xy, xy. File names show in the source file row. Once data is imported, you can do your analysis or chains of analysis such as stacking them, calculating columns, fitting, etc. Here, we will show an example of averaging the three data first, and then fitting the average data. Highlight all the data and choose Analysis, Mathematics, Average multiple curves. Set recalculation mode to auto and click OK. The average result sheet is created. Highlight the data and choose analysis, fitting, linear fit to do a linear fit. Change the recalculation mode to auto as well. OK, so we set up our analysis now. Let's say we have three more data files to analyze. We can right click the workbook title to duplicate the book without data. So, a new book is created with all the same structures being kept. Now, choose Data, Import from Files, Multiple ASCII again. Select another three files, for example, Sensor 4 to 6. The top of the Import dialog says Sheet, which means the previous import settings are saved in the sheet and will be used. For example, the multi-file import mode is Start New Columns. The column designation is XY. The file name will be put to user parameters now. So you just need to click OK to bring a new set of three data files. Once the new data is imported, the auto recalculation is triggered and we will get new average data and fit results automatically. If we want to do the same analysis with new data in the same book, we need to clear the data first. Otherwise, new data will be imported to new columns instead of replacing existing columns. So, click the edge of the worksheet to see the worksheet mini toolbar. Choose Clear Worksheet button. Click OK. Again, data is cleared, but the structure is kept. Use multiple ASCII import to bring new files. You can also save such workbook as an analysis template for further use. We can right click and choose Save as Analysis Template. Let's call it 3 Sensor Analysis. Now, start a new project. Choose File, Recent Books to load it. Import 3 data files. The average and fit will be done automatically. Thank you for watching.